what this master is saying. Uh, I don't agree with what this master said. The biggest mistake that NASA did, and that is when they handed over the election to, uh, to, to Jubilee, is allowing Raila Amolo Odinga to be the flag bearer. Right. See, he has tried and he has done so many times. And the, he has not changed the narrative. He had an opportunity at one time as a prime minister to make so many changes, which he did not. He has given so many promises that he has not fulfilled. At some point, the electorate gets tired because you bring back the same story, the same promises, the same, that when you go in, you're going to make this, you're going to make this, you're going to make this. But looking back and looking at the electorate, that has totally changed. They are becoming younger. They are becoming smarter. They are, they are willing to, 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 to bring a difference. How are you going to make a difference with a candidate who has tried so many times, getting older, with no new ideas? Whereas you look at the, 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 the party has totally changed. Look at the Jubilee, younger, smarter. They have so many ideas. And you look at what they have accomplished in these five years. People and the electorate agrees with them that surely the, the infrastructure has improved. <laughs> The standard of living has improved in Kenya. So much has happened. So I want to tell you for sure, I know that we are going in, but we'll come back here after, the day after. Yeah. And you, the, the Uhuru Kenyatta will be the president. Ben, allow me to make one point. It, 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 it will happen. You cannot, right. allow Kirua, seconds only. Yeah, you cannot allow Kirua to get with, away with murder. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yesterday, I saw President Kenyatta blaming Raila Odinga for the high cost of Unga, saying that if Raila had done what he was supposed to do four years ago, we wouldn't be having a Unga crisis in Kenya. But uh, maybe I've missed some sections of the Kenyan history. Ren Loding has never been president of Kenya to implement his agenda. As a so, prime minister, he had As a prime minister, he was, under, he was under President Kibaki. He's never been president for a day so that you can actually judge him. So this false narrative that is coming from Jubilee, that the rail has been around for a long time, mm -hmm. is a lie. If anything, President Kenyatta was born at State House, so he's been around for all this time. So he, 